Hey friends, thanks for the visit. If you're new to my channel, then welcome. I hope you'll stick around a while by smashing that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that post notification bell so that YouTube could notify you each and every time I post. Now, I have a substantial haul in front of me to share with you guys today. It is a hot rotisserie mess and it's all over the place. But nonetheless, I did find some goodies this time around. So if you're eager to see all I was able to score this week, then all you have to do is keep right on watching. So what I have before me is called the Dollar Tree Vomit, if you will. It's just an explosion and accumulation of all the stuff I was able to score this time around, but I don't have anything in order and it's just all over the place, as you see in containers and storage bins or whatever. So I'm just going to start with like the glassware to get that out of the way first, because those are the breakables. So what I scored this time around, which I picked up four, are these little whiskey glasses and and they just say craft product established 1794 whiskey and this is not a Dollar Tree product this is a Crystar is the name brand and so I picked up four I thought these were really really nice and well made and they do have quite some weight to them so I have a couple of idea in mind for these so I picked up four so I'm continuing on with the glass products this is not a new item but I picked up two of these uh it has sort of a hurricane uh, shape to it. Um, I've seen these and passed them up before, but I had a holiday DIY in mind to do with these. So I grabbed two and brought them home. Also found this adorable mug that you see right here. And it just says, I'm dreaming of a white Christmas on it. And it has that buffalo check pattern and the font on both sides of the cup. I just thought it was really well made and I had to bring it home. It's stinking adorable few holiday decor that I found this time around. I found this wall art mural and it's just some little like Klingons if you will stickers and it has the red truck, the camper, Santa Claus, the penguin and you put them on the wall. So I had something in mind for these. They also had this little wall decoration and it's just an image of a fireplace with the stockings hung. Sorry for the glare. I did pick up two of those. And then this is an item that if you wait until the last minute, you're going to be out of luck because you won't find them. I remember last year needing one in desperate need of one of these large sacks and I couldn't find them at any of my Dollar Trees and I ended up paying double the cost or triple the cost somewhere else so I picked up two of these and these are just those huge sacks that you can use to put Christmas presents in and these save lives trust me so I picked up two then I picked up this little cutie and it's just your little faux acrylic uh, storage container and it has the adorable vintage red truck with the snowman and the Christmas trees and it has the little sign flag that says North Pole and it just opens with this lid and it has this little uh suction seal so it secures really really tightly i actually left it ajar for video purposes because i didn't want to be tugging at it but this really has a secure airtight seal so that's also a plus next up i picked up this adorable little container and it's just a little storage container and i did pick up several patterns which i will share with you in a minute but for video purposes i did store most of the items inside because i tell you everything was a hot rotisserie mess and all over the place so to try to contain it a little i did store some things inside so i picked up this pattern here that says comfort and joy with the gingerbread house and the little gingerbread boy and girl and then inside here I just put this little candle and it just says um, mistletoe and wonderful time of the year and it has a star and it's kind of like forming the shape of a tree in red if you will and it only has the print on one side um, doesn't smell too promising like it's gonna have a really good throw but I actually just picked it up for the aesthetics of course because it's you know seasonal 
then I hauled this last year. I actually have two other ones, but I needed one more for a project. So, cause I actually utilized one of the ones that I purchased last year in a tiered tray. Cause these are good, not only for ornaments, which are their intended purposes, but they're also good to put in tiered trays and small little spaces as such. Um, I hauled this little sign that says believe in the magic of Christmas because Dollar Tree, believe it or not, they did their thing this year and they have an array of items of de seasonal decor items this year out with the uh, buffalo um red and black buffalo plaid uh, pattern on it and I thought this would go really well with some of the items that I already picked up such as that cup that I showed earlier on the mugs so I grabbed these items picked up some of this Arm & Hammer extra strand carpet odor and eliminator and this is the one with uh, oxy plus and dirt fighters it smells wonderful and so I grabbed a box then next up, I hold this uh, stuff that's in this bin, and I'll try to go through it pretty quickly because there is quite a few items that I still have to share. So I hold these two uh, City Colors palettes, and I guess this is a Christmas edition because it says Ooh La La, and it, I'll open it so you can see the colors. And so the names of the, of the colors are Mona Lisa, Notre Dame, Moulin Rouge, Champ El Elise, Celine, Lavore, Eiffel Tower, Versailles. There's all macaron. There's a bunch of really nice um, colors in it. And the fact that they say ooh la la, you know, it just screams Christmas and I picked up two. Then the last time I was there I was looking for this color of the mini mums and I was only able to find one and this time I found one more. It seems like they're putting them for me there for me one at a time so I'll take it. I picked up this one because I need it for a DIY and I brought it home. Um, brought home a couple of air fresheners. Uh, I love this Glade uh, spray and the fresh lemon it just smells so good i love to spray this in my kitchen especially if i'm frying after i'm done frying it just gives a nice um lemony fresh aromatic afterwards so i picked up two of these because they're not always there and then i love this angel of mine uh baby room air freshener it has like a powder fresh scent and I like to keep this in my powder room it just smells amazing so I find this in the uh, kids aisle the baby section so I brought one of those home too so next up they had some new bath fizzies for kids and these are from the uh, Frozen 2 movie and they come with eight watercolor tablets inside this little box so i picked up one frozen and two of the toy story four which they also include eight and this says ages three and up and i figured these would make cute little stocking stuffers so i brought these home next i picked up two of these little reusable uh stocking totes if you will i grabbed one with the santa claus emojis on it with the hard eyes and the candy cane and this a little elf emoji here and then this one has the star wars with the jetta and all of that so i picked up one of each and i thought these were a cool score and i was happy to find these and then i was also happy to see come across this little tote that says merry christmas it only has the wording on one side but that's okay i like that it has these little handles and i can put together a really cute little gift basket with this which is what i picked it up for so i had to bring it home then just like the gingerbread one that i shared with you earlier with the little gingerbread boy and girl they had this one with the vintage red truck the snowman and the christmas trees and it just says merry christmas on it i also put some stuff inside to share with you they had these centos scented markers and this one is a uh, blueberry brute and this one is watermelon melon and so i picked up a pink and a blue because i figured these would also make great stocking stuffers as well so i grabbed those two 
Um, speaking of stocking stuffers, I found this little uh, My Own Paper Doll kit, and it's one kit, and you assemble the little doll, and she has uh, interchanging clothes that you can put different outfits on her and stuff, and I thought this would make a cute stocking stuffer as well, and I grabbed two packs of these uh, snowflakes. They're not felt. They're kind of, I guess they're foam. Yeah, they say foam sheets, but they don't feel really thick. They're like a really thin foam. So I just picked up two in the blue and the white. Then in the last storage container that I have to share with you is this one that says Santa's cookies on it. And they also have a little play on the uh, plaid. This is not buffalo check. It's just like a like a regular plaid. So I have it filled with some goodies as well that I will share with you. So I was able to find um, the uh, Sure Sense scented oil warmer diffuser. And this is the uh, Sure Sets brand uh, plug-in that you plug in the wall. And they also had the corresponding uh, scents to go in it. So these are the the fillers if you will and they had the uh, Hawaiian scent and the fresh linen so I picked up two of each to see how they do and this says that it fits the Glade and Airwick wall warmers as well so you could interchange some if you are not able to find the sure sense one it says it'll work well with the Glade and the Airwick as well too so I thought that was good to know so I picked up those then the last time I was there, I picked up multiples of these little uh, fragrance oil and I want to say it was like a rose or a raspberry scent. This time around I found a pomegranate which is a new scent. I never seen this one there before and it smells really good. I like to use this in conjunction with my essential oils. I use it to you know stretch it if you will for the longevity of it and so I just blend the essential oils together with this and my um, oil diffuser and it just smells wonderful and it's been working fine for me so far so whenever I see these I grab them so I picked up those four. Um, I just grabbed a pack of these regular regular ornaments and these are just snowflakes and it's a six pack. It comes with six snowflakes inside. If I don't use them on my tree then I will use them in a DIY. Speaking of DIY I found a, pack, a 12 piece pack of these felt stickers with the Santa Claus hats and they're um, I want to say they're self-adhesive. You can always feel free to use a little bit of crafted glue as well for extra security. But I thought they were so cute with the little pom-poms and stuff. So I picked up one pack of those. Then I needed another pack of these... Um, color your own ornament decorations and these are just the stockings i picked up one pack i needed another one for a project and last but not least was this little happy holidays mason jar i a haul the other one in a haul prior and it was like a tan color but i never found this um black one so I picked it up because I thought it was stinking adorable and I needed to bring it home and I love the little red truck so I'm probably going to leave it like this until past the holidays and then I'll do a craft with it afterwards. And that my subby friends will complete this haul. This concludes all the items that I had to share with you this time around. If you like any of the items that I was able to share with you in this haul please do not hesitate to give my video a thumbs up. It will help me out so much so that YouTube could recognize my channel just a little bit more as a growing channel. And as always, I will speak to you again in my next video. I will meet you back here in the next Dollar Tree haul. Bye guys. Talk to you soon.